Scott. I'm Daniel. Cameron's up. Monty. Mike. Mike. There's five of you. We'll go five. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, well, we left, we left out Randy. There's Randy. <laughs> and how'd you guys get you first in line out of everyone here? Camped up. Strategizing <laughs> and over-strategizing. Over-strategizing. Picking the closest spot to this line. Did you have to go to every single game before now? Yeah, we've been for we've been front row to every game for multiple years. Multiple years. So you were here for this game last year? Yeah. And were you first in line then too? Yep. You were. So you've, you've got this plan worked out for a while now. Uh, well, they've changed the system. I per like A lot of us were kind of mixed up. I personally have been, this will be my third year for, for the KU game. I've, I've been fortunate with the lottery systems we use. So uh, this year was more just by strategy rather than luck. So, uh, so yeah, we, we, planned, we planned it out really well on how we did. We had guys pretty much everywhere, but we made sure we were closer than any of the other spots you could line up. How long have you been out here? We got here at 11 p.m. Say the night. You've been out here overnight? Yes. Well, not in the parking lot. Not in the parking lot. We have been over there outside. We were, we were not inside of the building. We were outside in the cold for, since 11 o'clock. Yeah, so you had to do that on top of the lottery system? Yeah. There was no lottery there was, there was no lottery this year. Lottery has been used in the past. It was a fair system. It, this was a more, a more fair system. The system was merely just to get your wristbands. To yeah, say and, that it was, and it was a first come, in. first serve basis after that. So wow. We just had to camp out and make sure we were first. Is there a particular spot in the front so you get first pick in the entire stadium? Uh, yeah, we always pick for the front row center court. Right, uh, My spot's usually right on the right side of center court. Uh, Mike usually sets directly across from me on center court on the left side. So we just kind of expand. From the Do you guys have any signs or anything? Yeah, we actually, K-State has five traditional signs we hold up. Uh, you'll see them when they announce the starting rotation for the uh, opposing team. Uh, they, they, they just say, who cares, so what, big deal, uh, who's he, go home. And they've, they've been a K-State tradition for over a decade. So uh, we are the only people who know where they are, and we are the ones who get to hold them up. So it's pretty cool. Awesome. All right, cool. Congratulations, guys. Are you going to do this next year or is this show last year? Uh, I'm a senior, but I'll be back next year. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, high five, guys. 6 a.m. 6 a.m. So you got here at 6 a.m. when the lot opened? Yeah. Yes. Yep. And what is that time? Do you get in after all the ICAT or just? Uh, 15 minutes after. 15 minutes after. Okay, so you'll still get pretty good seats. Yep. Yeah, well, yep. we still have like, our own section that they can't sit in, so we'll get like front row seats. Nice. So, uh, has it been cold? Yes, very cold. It's been very cold. <laughs> very, very cold. And have you guys been taking shifts or what? Do you have a system? Kind of every once in a while. Go to call. She slept for about three hours. I took a nap. I had to take a nap. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. <laughs> We've all been strong out here, though. <laughs> group huddles keep us together. How many is in your group? Uh, we just combined about yeah, we combined. So yeah, we just kind of met everybody here. So. We became a group. We became a group over the 13 hours. Yeah, yeah. we bonded so well. <laughs> Who do you think is going to win the game today? Cats, let's go! What? So no one wants to be your friend, I guess, anymore. I guess not. <laughs> so are you here with anyone? Let's start with that. I actually go to school here. You go to school here? Yeah, I'm a business major. But my education has nothing to do with sporting events. I'm a KU fan since I was born. And so I picked a school based on education, not on sports. What's your name? Jeremy Alexander. <laughs> Jeremy Alexander. I'm yeah. Jeremy, too. Oh, okay. <laughs> nice to meet you. Uh, so do you cheer for KU in everything? Uh, yeah. Rough? KU fan through and through, regardless of win or lose. No disrespect to K-State fans or K-State. It has nothing to do with... Uh, I respect K-State as a, as a sporting school, but I mean, I'm just a K KU fan. <laughs> Are you, do you support K-State in other, like other sporting events when they're not playing KU? Uh, yeah, I would. I have no, like I said, I have no, I'm from Missouri, Joplin, so I have, I'm not a Mizzou fan at all either. So, I'm just a KU fan. There's nothing <laughs> I can say to uh, make these guys any happier, I guess, but I guess I don't really care. So is this the only game you go to a year? No, I, my fiance is a KU fan, and so I go to games whenever she makes me go. <laughs> <laughs> so is she your bodyguard, protect you? No. I, I, no. I don't think... Well, there might be some problems, but I hope not. But if there is, I guess it happens. But I've been through, I went to a Mizzou game in Missouri, in Columbia, wearing KU gear in the student section. So I don't think this is going to be too difficult. What do you think the score will be? Uh, I hope KU's on top. That's all I know. But if it's not, then I mean, it's a game. I mean, people win. Someone's got to lose. So 
Like I said, no disrespect to K-State sporting fans whatsoever. But Which one's your fiance? <laughs> What's your name? That's me. Trista. <laughs> Does he embarrass you? Um, I could care less. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well you guys have a good day. What's your name, sir? Black Coco! How long have you been out here? Too long! Is it cold? Yes! Tell me how you feel right now. I'm ready to kick some car, you What's uh what's the score gonna be? 200 to zero. Who's <laughs> 200 to zero who? Wildcats, baby! Woo! <laughs>